streets. The Three County Fair is a famous annual fair in Northampton as dozens of amazing rides and delicious food. I should have shaved. Look at this. We hit the streets of the Three County Fair to test the rides and eat the food. First, I have up a fried Oreo. Very exquisite. Okay, you know what? I rate it up an 8 out of 10. That's what I give it. It's good for the soul. And now we have come to the corn dog. Good. The hot dog with, you know, corn. I don't know what this is. Dough, maybe, on a stick. You can't go wrong with that. Probably give it like a five out of ten. Like it's, it's good, but I wouldn't. You know, it was five dollars, so I wouldn't spend five dollars on this. Teen fries, let's um, let's dig in. Very good. Very salty. Wow. Too salty. I think it's six six out of ten. Use a fork. Delicious. The gravy is awesome, and there's a cheese curd right there. Mm. Really good. I'll give it like a seven out of ten. Thanks so much for watching. See you next week. FlexBlock is a new period implemented this year at NHS to be a time where students can meet with teachers and catch up on work. On the first day of every week, each student will schedule which teacher they will meet with on which day for the rest of the week. We interviewed various students during lunch to get their first impressions on the new system and how they think it will go. I think Flexbox will positively affect my um, experience at NHS because I like the uh, sound room or whatever you want to call it, lab, um, and I don't play instruments, but I'm more into like beat making and I'm saving up for a pad, so Flexbox really helps me like I don't know, finish up homework, projects I got going on during then. Uh, I hope to get out of Flexbox uh, doing my homework, like more homework time. I hope that Flexblock will eventually become a place where all students can get the academic help they need or just not do that if they don't need that. I think the administration is kind of forcing us into a certain pattern right now that I don't think is necessarily any more helpful than the old way it was before where people would just ask for help and advocate for themselves. Um, but I think Flexblock could be a welcome addition to the school day at NHS. I hope to get out of Flexbox a time where we can meet with clubs and stuff because the whole point of it is that you don't have to stay after school and get a different ride home and you do it during school in the middle of the day. But 30 minutes is really not enough, 35 I think. We have to have a little bit more time to meet with clubs and meet with teachers and retake tests and that's just not what they're giving us. It's all or nothing. Over the past few months, several government buildings around the valley have been dealing with issues of mold growth, resulting in closures and delays in openings. In August, the Springfield Courthouse was forced to shut its doors due to the conditions over mold. And South Hadley Public Schools have been forced to start the year remotely due to similar findings. We spoke to several students at NHS to understand their thoughts on the issue. The mold in the rooms hasn't affected me much, but I've heard a lot of people that have had rooms moved and all that stuff, so it causes a lot of commotion just for everyone. 
messes things up. So yeah, it's an inconvenience for sure. Uh, yes, I think it did have an effect on the start of the school year because I on Thursday morning I was like prepared to get up and go to school, but I kind of had to like move that anticipation to Friday and all through um, Thursday I think I was like kind of hyping myself up to go to school the next day. The way Sal Hadley did it was that everybody just went remote and like students are not attending in person and for some students I feel like going in person will help more than just remote because it helped me and the way that I've seen so far into the school year has helped me a lot instead of just like remotely and my grades just dropping down so I prefer going in person and remote but I feel like NHS did a good job so far I haven't seen anyone affected